sell the pigs. I can finish the house. You know, today I put in the toilet. You want to come and see the house? What for? What's that supposed to mean? Father, I want to talk to you. About what? I've been waiting all day for you. Maybe I shouldn't have come back here. I don't think I can live in this house anymore. Unless we can talk. There's two grown people, Father. Okay, talk. I understand about the Lila. I've gone through a lot of things. And I've changed. I know you have to have your own life. We all do. Understand. You know, I've been worried. God damn it. She should be here when I come home. Hmm. Is that what you wanted to say? No. Father. I love you. We all love you. But you don't love us. So I don't love you. Maybe you don't even realize it. What don't I realize? That you're always humiliating us. You've done for Tony in a few days. What you haven't done for us in a lifetime. I've always fed you. Have you ever gone hungry? No. You've always given us bread. A roof. But do you know why I ever left this house? Because you forced me to. And do you know what I always wanted to be, Father? A nun. I always wanted to enter a convent. But I couldn't. Because you never gave me your name. But Tonya, you'd give her your name right away. I'm sure of that. I'll give her my name. Maybe I'll give her fur coats and jewels. Maybe, maybe I'll give her a limousine. Father, do you know what they're saying? The whole visiting time. What are they saying? That you're in love with your own daughter. That you want to go to bed with her. God, that's... You, Don't touch me. You can have your Tonya and all the other women you want. But I'm leaving. As far as I'm concerned, you're dead. Dead. Dead.
examinations. You're a stewardess now. Dear God, I'm free. (laughs) 